Howdy y'all, it's your host Road. welcome back to Love It Games. We're going to play a little Saints Row today, so uh, please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, tell me what you think in the comment section down below, we're going to see what we can get into. So, let us go right into the game, and have some fun. Like, comment, subscribe, share the video. So, I think today we are going to uh, bust out some of these wanteds. But I'd like to finish them all. Do the necromancer. I'd like to get all the wanted missions done. My guy. Let's take on a. Oh, he just drove in this mountain. One way to land. I don't want it to be too close. I don't want the helicopter to disappear. Which has happened to me more times than I remember. you had a LARP hit for me? Great, Bessonius! We beseech you to destroy the necromancer that has taken control of the graveyard. Listen close. The necromancer is a traitorous ass. We once shared a raiding party, but when I was attacked and passed into the great beyond, she did not revive me. We were friends. She had the resources to save me, but she let my favorite character die. I shall see to it that she feels the pain of re-rolling. Oh, it's a LARP hit. That's even better. I want to do this with a shotgun. Higher sword! How dare you disturb the great necromancer! The hour of your demise is at hand, foul fiend! You shall rue the day you backstabbed your friend. Protect me, thralls! We shall send you to your maker. Melee death your, your treachery protect. hath not been forgotten. <sighs> Doesn't even hurt. Oh. I call upon my dark arts. Do your worst. I cast the spell of mass resurrect. Arise, my thralls. Are you fucking kidding me? No wonder she put a hit out on you. You're powerful enough to save your whole raiding party, but you chose not to. Hey, I worked hard on this character, and betraying my party is what my character would do. And I can only cast it once per day, so just suck it up. Fine, whatever. All my thralls have fallen to dust. I myself must take arms against the higher sword. I shall make you pay for that in blood. <laughs> You got a different type of you weapon. You can't kill me because I quit. I'm going to join the LARP in Maker City. They actually like narrative twists and betrayal plot lines. Cool. You do you. Your revenge hath been fulfilled. She's off to join another LARP. Good. The door can't hit her where the gods hath split her. That's one more down. Meltervale, he's at loss. El Machino. Oh, oh, that's so lucky. Dude, I cannot believe. I, I'm usually getting people way across the freaking map. Actually, get somebody who I'm right next to. 
Even though I could still be required to drive across the map. Hey, I saw your post on Wanted. You put a hit on one of your own? Hell yeah. That pendejo has cheated me for the last time. Can't do it yourself? He knows I'm looking for him, so he's hiding behind some heavies. All right, so what's the plan? Go get Pepito's car. He's real popular in Los Panteros. No one will be suspicious if they think you're him. Where does he park? At the hot sauce factory. Flaming hot panther juice. Ooh, flaming hot panther juice. Now, I do like some hot sauces. Well, some. I like most hot sauces. Christmas is coming up. Birthday's coming up. Birthday's January 1st. And if anyone felt like it. But, uh... See what we can do here. Oh no, I need to steal the truck, not blow the truck to smithereens. Nice talk. I'm at the spot. Pepito's truck is all tricked out. Drive it over to the hangout. So why put a hit on another Pantero? I thought y'all were all about family. He saw me shitty car parts. Twice. Almost blew a hole in my engine block. So it's a fool me twice, I put a hit on you kind of deal? <laughs> you get it. Man. You understand that. And then in another instance, uh... Did you look over the car part? Because a lot of them... Either work or they don't, and you could visually see it. Depends on what it is. If it looks through it went looks like it went right. through an ass grinder, then you know I that it's fucked. To get past his people. And kill that asshole. Make it good. Hola Pepito, come on in. Wait, you're not Pepito! I surprised myself. Oh. Hey, your boys kicked the bucket. Thanks for that. Enjoy the cash. You hit stand. Oh, I was gonna blow up the vehicle. You just steal? No, it's not the same vehicle. Leave them in pieces. I don't see him. You hit a fucking Panteros? Yes, I did. I don't care that you're a Panteros. Now you've done it. Who are we going after now? They were like family to me. All right. I mean, we're whipping these heads right out. I didn't think they'd be going this fast, but hey, we don't know until you know. Hey, live nude show.
Hey, I saw your post on Wanted. Yes. I will need you to acquire a limousine. Okay. A specific limousine. The two men expecting the limousine to arrive, they will think you are their security. They have hired Marshall to protect themselves. Most inconvenient. Ain't no problem. I know how to handle Marshall. So these two fellas. They are frequent guests of my casino. At first I thought they were just lucky. And then you found out they was cheating? Yes. They broke my heart. I have one other request. The deed. It should be done at the train tracks. The three of us, we came into Santo Ileso on that train together. So long ago. You're new. Lee off tonight? Yes. Lee ain't feeling well. Marshall's in charge here. Walk with him. Please not be today. Try not to make him suspicious. Until I get there. I'd say I like the white limos. A little bit better than the black limos. Sands won't last a month out here. Sir, sir, that's not your driver. Fucking finally. It's not good customer service to keep your client waiting. Bruno, how's business? Couldn't be better. Very lucrative night. I busted flush. Maybe be a little careful. It's one of Dom's. So what if it is? Dom hasn't caught on yet. True enough. Couldn't do much if he did catch on. Toothless old coot. Ah, he's lost his edge. All he wants to do is sit around and smoke cigars and reminisce. So long ago, we came to Santo Ileso. Young men together. <laughs> he never had any edge to lose. He was an idiot back then, too. He still doesn't know it was me who cooked the books back when he ran the first place together. Ah, Dom. You don't cheat your friends, man. That's your fam. Holy Jesus. Shit. Hey, what the fuck? What the hell are we doing in this part of town? Driver, these doors are locked. Driver, what's the kid's name? Not Lee. I can't get the doors open. Help! Help! Somebody help! That's a fucking train! That's how you do it. You broke Dom's heart. It's done. Thank you. And now you must excuse me. This is a sad day for my family. I can understand. You don't fuck over your friends. Fill each other up, don't tear each other down. Sending coded messages. Alright, you're far as fuck away. We are gonna go get a helicopter. Ugh. Hey, you're on the whole other side of the map. No, I deleted my pimped out copter. Fuck.
Maybe. That suck if I actually just lost my helicopter. They should have you confirm if you're deleting a vehicle permanently. That sucks. And that's when I learned the importance of reading the directions. I like this. Come on, helicopter, still be there. Drive. Did it not start the mission? Yeah, it says before I started it. We gotta do more with the murder island too, because that's on unlock stuff for us as well. We really pushed through the main story a lot and then have really slacked on a lot of the side stuff. Which actually reminds me. Take an extra 300,000. Swift boot of Marshall. Not that scary of a thing is somebody flying a helicopter. Hello. Yeah, I saw your post. Need a spy taken out? Shh, they could be listening. Okay. So, during my ancient astronaut podcast last week, I picked up a coded message by a Russian or a North Korean or... or Canadian spy. Right. I know it sounds crazy. It sure does. Our national security is on the line here. I tracked the signal to the spy's hideout. Okay, I'll look into it. Looks good. I thought I had all the pictures. Guess not. I know I don't have all the collectibles. Let's have a look-see. Quiet. Too quiet. Hmm. Locked. Ain't no one home. Are you sure this is the place? Absolutely. Well, I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Any outbuildings? A, a trailer or something? I'll check.
There's an RV. That RV looks sketchy as a six dollar bill. Ah, Jesus, just blew up. Booby traps. You see, I was right. Okay, so maybe you're on to something here. Of course I am. Everything I believe is true. Ah. Someone's camped up on that hill. Is it the spy? Seeing as they're shooting at me, yes. Okay, take them out. Oh, we're gonna take them out. We're gonna go out to a nice pizza dinner. Why? I like that one. Later, Gator. It's done. <laughs> All those trolls who made fun of me can eat it. I have no idea where my vehicle went. I thought I was going the right way, but I was not. This pisses me off. <clears throat> Guess we're gonna do a hidden history since uh, we're here. History of Santo Eliso, visit Go Kart Go in El Dorado. Listen to every panel at both sites to win a prize. I am too drunk to give a fuck. I saw something. Usually they're along things like roads, pathways, not seeing anything here. There's one. Oh, but here's one. Did you know? Abner Pulley Whitaker was a machinist for the Pacific National Railroad. In 1884, he built a kerosene fueled, steam powered, horseless carriage in this very shed. So did anyone hear about the uh, guy who just, uh, he made this multi-million dollar company in like South Africa and he made an engine and a vehicle. Did you know that, uh, Whitaker tested his horseless carriage on this very site, reaching speeds of nearly 15 miles per hour, the vehicle rocketed across the lake bed to set a new county record. He made a vehicle and an engine, and uh, the engine also can work on your house, what is powered by atmospheric pressure. It doesn't use a combustion style, no, so no fuels needed or anything like that. It uses the atmospheric pressure to run. And supposedly one of these engines, which are very cheaply made, can power up to 300 homes. As soon as he uh, published it in America, he went missing. Alacran has been dry for over 200 years. Boaters, swimmers, and anglers eagerly await the day when its cool, refreshing waters flow once again. The whole thing with it is that his company still has all the patents and how to do it. It's like in South America. They're still wanting to progress with it, and people from his company keep going missing. Did you? Exploded on this very spot, nearly ending his life. 
In 1896, he would establish the Scorpion Automobile Company in Smelterville. But yeah, this dude went missing after he tried to come to America to defend what he wanted to produce here. And the government, American government, has been trying to hide all evidence of it. Pretty crazy. You learn something new every day, I guess. This speedster needs a pit stop if you catch my drift. K-979. This machine's a legend. When we're out here, we see some to go to. We're going to just hit it up real quick. Save us a future trip. Where is it? Yeah, but that story is a legit story published by one of my favorite cheese heads, Joe Gillespie. Shabadoo, baby. Shabadoo. Don't crash. Let's get to this drop dead location. Up. Hey, I saw your post on Wanted. I need you to take out my rival, Nikki the Speed Queen Owens. She's dominating the circuit and I can't take it anymore. You sound like a sore loser. Sore loser? Do you want the money or not? Sure. Where do I find her? They're running an illegal street race in Lakeshore. Look for Nikki at the front of the pack. I stashed a cart for you so you can blend in. On it. Oh, crap. I don't want to have to race in this. I've got the cart. How do you want me to do this? Use the cart to make it look like an accident. Like she lost control and crashed. You got it. Meep meep. How am I supposed to take somebody out with a go-kart? Dude, what the hell is with everything being busted? The pack, and that looks like the speed queen. Putting you in the back of the pack. <laughs> Get back here. All right, all right. 
Every time I catch up to her, she's hitting somebody. Don't blow up my freaking vehicle. I'm about to take out Marshall. Are you insane? Fuck you up. Damn, she's fast. Come on. You're gonna make me spin out. She's roadkill. Yes! Now I have a chance at the title. I hope it was worth it. Another wanted. I need an executive to execute an executive. How far are you? Nineteen hundred meters. It honestly may be faster to go. Oops. There you go. Let's just. Warp, grab a helicopter, go take a mail. No matter what, we're 300 meters closer than we just were. And we can get a helicopter. Don't do that same mistake again. This is my pimp and saints copter. I don't understand people getting scared and screaming when you're just flying, landing a helicopter. If you were near them, one, that'd be one thing. Yeah, who's this? I saw your post on Wanted. You want to take out a Marshall executive? There's a helicopter waiting for you in Monte Vista. Get in and I'll tell you more. On my way. I'm already in a helicopter. Uh, I mean, if it is an attack helicopter, I've been trying to get one of those. Does not look like an attack helicopter. I'm in the helicopter. Now, what's the target? Marshall's VP of security, Howard Clark. Clark? 
That guy's paranoid as fuck. How are we gonna find him? Through Gordy Page, his second in command. I put a tracker on Gordy's car. He's in Lakeshore right now. Sounds like you've been planning this for a while. You bet your ass I have. Opportunities like this don't just happen. It takes painstaking surveillance and information gathering. Huh. My part always seems so simple. Well, now that you know how much work I put in, don't fuck it up. Uh huh. Leave the it to me to fuck it up. With a magnet strong enough to pick up Gordy's car. That should get him talking. I'll send you his number for negotiations. He's in a limo. Got it. Time to get this asshole on the horn. Mr. Page, how are you enjoying the flight so far? Who is this? Put me down at once! I'm looking for your boss. Where can I find him? I said put me down or you're fucking dead! Better fasten your seatbelt. Howard Clark. Kiss my ass! I don't know if you want to go down that route, buddy. It won't be the first person I accidentally drop. Shit! Or the last. I can do this all day. I'll lose my job if I tell you. I think you would have just lost your shit right there. Are you crazy? You'll lose more than a job if you don't talk. He's at a meeting. I don't know where. Don't lie to me, Gordy. Where is he? I'll send you the address. <laughs> just let me go. Shit. Clark just got in that helicopter. Can't let him get away. Bet I could use Gordy's car to knock Clark off the roof. <laughs> that should do it. Oh my god! You killed Howard! Oh, this is perfect! Yeah? How so? Once I turn your dumb ass over to the cops, I'll get promoted to VP! VP? Well, why don't we go check out your new office? Shit! I'll just drop you off here. What? What? We're going to drop you off at your new office. Uh huh. It said drop them off. Really? Yeah. Who's this? I saw your post on Wanted. You want to take out a Marshall executive? There's a helicopter waiting for you in Monte Vista. Get in and I'll tell you more. On my way. I'm in the helicopter. Now, what's the target? Marshall's VP of security. That sucks. Clark. Clark. That guy's paranoid as fuck. How are we going to find him? Through Gordy Page, his second in command. I put a tracker on Gordy's car. He's in Lakeshore right now. Sounds like you've been planning this for a while. You bet your ass I have. Opportunities like this don't just happen. It takes painstaking surveillance and information gathering. Huh. My part always seems so simple. Well, now that you know how much work I put in, don't fuck it up. Oh, I'll fuck your it up. Your helicopter is equipped with a magnet. Strong enough to pick up Gordy's car. That should get him talking. I'll send you his number for negotiations. That did Hold not go up. For a hot minute. Got it. Time to get this asshole on the horn. 
Mr. Page, how are you enjoying the flight so far? Who is this? Put me down at once! I'm looking for your boss. Where can I find him? I said put me down, or you're fucking dead! Better fasten your seatbelt. Where is Howard Clark? Kiss my ass! Are you crazy? Yes. I can do this all day. I'll lose my job if I tell you. What are you doing? I'm giving you a tour of the city. You'll lose more than a job if you don't talk. He's at a meeting. I don't know where. Oh, you know where. Don't lie to me, Gordy. Where is he? I'll send you the address. <laughs> Just let me go. Shit. Clark just got in that helicopter. Can't let him get away. Bet I could use Gordy's car to knock Clark off the roof. That should do it. Oh my god! You killed Howard! Oh, this is perfect! Yeah? How so? Once I turn your dumb ass over to the cops, I'll get promoted to VP! VP? Well, why don't we go check out your new office? I'll just drop you off here. What? What? Ah! Took care of Clark and Gordy. Excellent. I'll wire you the money. There we go. Don't put me on the ground. Don't put me on the ground. In a helicopter, all of it put me on. All right. Well, we're gonna go back to our place so we have a helicopter let's check out the next one of that our wrestler there's only two we're gonna go to the desert Surprised the idols don't have a helicopter. Lord Colin. Dude, this guy really is way the hell out of the desert. Or at least the burner phone is. Stuck in the desert with a horse with no name. Dun, dun, dun. Hey, a hole. Secret tunnel. Yeah, I wasn't trying to go all the way down. I don't know what that symbol is. Getaway driver. Hey, saw your wanted post. Whatever you need doing, I'm in. A bunch of those pink-haired idols punks are defacing the desert. Take them out. Defacing the desert? What are you, park ranger? Uh, it doesn't matter who I am. I'm the person telling you to wipe out the idols. That's all you need to know. For littering. You want the fucking job or not? Yes, sir. Sorry. The first group is out at the Overlook. Oh, and make sure you get the ringleader. Big asshole in a helmet. I get to kill the last collective member? Oh, I am so there.
Naval car parts. Quit falling out of the helicopter. That ain't cool. That ain't cool. That ain't cool. My helicopter fall down? I eat those for breakfast. That sucks. That sucks. So many things. Ah, uh, let's see. Can't use contacts. Fucking A, dude. This is my car now. Can't think of a better way to actually, uh, to disrupt some idols as, uh, coming in with a police car. Oh, I have to go up trails. This is where a helicopter would have been useful. Found your idols. They are definitely not keeping the park clean. Then you scrub it down for them. Ugh. Give a shit. Stop the loot. I got other places to be. That one had to hurt. Slide. Gotta kill him with heavy attacks. Oh, there's a helicopter up here. The overlook's clean now, except for all the bodies. Good, but that's just the first group. I'll send you the location of the others. Take the helicopter. Is it straight down? Oh. Kind of lucky that didn't just blow up on me. No, don't jump off. Ship's helm? We got a runner. Follow them to the idol's camp. They'll lead you to the asshole with the helmet. Go on. My friend, my friend. Where are you going? I got awesome deal for you. You show me where your collective is and I kill you all. I found the camp. That's where you'll find Helmet Guy. Cut off the head and the snake will die. Where are they? You 
think that hurt? Should have stayed home with Mama. Ah! Know who I am? Because I sure know who you are. Even, even if you kill me, the Collective will rise like a phoenix from the grave. More glorious and more powerful than... Maybe. But they'll do it without you. It's all... dark. Job's done. Good. Hey, since you're a park ranger and all, does that make this a government-sponsored hit? Because that's kind of on my bucket list. No. <laughs> no. So we have taken out all the members of the collective. What is this new one? It's a major perk. Deal less damage but gain more flow whenever you hit an enemy. Yeah. Wait, no. No, I don't want that. The flow I hardly ever use. All right, well, we're going to warp back. Wherever we were, so is there, coming through here, we saw somewhere over here there was, those lit up finally, so there's three, four. Who am I in combat with? There's no one alive. Oh shit, it's the green sabra. All big smoke. Somebody's coming out for CJ. Look at you with your bad self. Bingo. This town have Chinese food? Every town has Chinese food. I need to paint over some graffiti. Sweet. Chinese food is the one thing that never has to advertise. It's almost always amazing. And it leaves you hungry after about 45 minutes so you're going to order it again. Look what I found. That should have, yeah, sweet. So now we have five, six, seven. Need to get these finished up. To worry about. Use some ice cream right now. I've been trying to get that done for the longest time now. All right. Not skills. Wanted. Honestly, not that far. 200 meters. I, when it says car wrestler, it makes me think that I'm going to have to race.
Howdy. Saw your post. What do you need? A no-good lowlife's been stealing cars around these parts. I demand vigilante justice. How can I make that happen? I set aside a bait car for you. It is just her type. I'll go get it. Okay, I found the car. What's next? Next, we blow them sky high. I left a bomb for you to attach to the car. Damn. Well, this is getting interesting. The bomb is on the car. Now to set the trap for this some bitch. Here's where you can park the car. Heading there now. Shouldn't I have uh, put the car in the location before I then place the bomb? I'm literally driving around with a stack of TNT on my bumper. And Santo Elise, where everybody loves to hit you just because the sky is blue. Trap is set. I'll go wait across the street. She looks suspicious. The target's in the car. Shit, the remote's not working. One day you'll laugh about this. Got her. Hell yeah. No more car rustlers in my neighborhood, no sir. There you go. New weapon patterns. That was all the one it had. And we made another. Almost one million dollars right there. So let's see what we do with these murder circuses. So we can go with Chief Justice, Constance Ruiz. We get a dark shot with him, Moltov with her, Bulldogs with her. Rival suit, frag grenade. I don't like that. What's the boot coin? Orium. Your headshots kill automatic refills your takedown meter. Purchase chance when the caskets get. That's cool. I'm gonna go with her first. First purchase and upgrade in the boot. I can only choose one. Pleasure doing business. The more goodies you buy, the better your chances. Now head back to the contestant select screen and pick a contender to your very first murder circus run. Don't get too attached. I hope you're not squeamish. I'll mount your heads as trophies on my wall. That should bring a spark of joy back into life. Each run of Doc Ketchum's Murder Circus features four caskets chaos. Follow the clues of the map and the HUD to find each one. 
Activate a casket of chaos to kick off a brutal, bloody, non hulled war battle. The last survivor collects a prize. Finish all four caskets to win. Wait, what do I got? So I got this with like infinite run. These wolves hunt in a pack. I do believe Great Aunt Petronella married a Ketchum. All right. So what is this fire? I see a fire. Each cast of chaos features a cask and condition, an extra breath to toughen up the enemies. See the conditions on the minimap. They tell you what the chaos condition goes with each casket tab to glory details. Our competitors have found the Rifle kills. Why am I catching fire? without the skis. <laughs> Don't quite know if I'm going the right way, but we're about to find out. Fresh is that blood. Oh shit, that was crazy. I'm ah. gonna beat your ass. Yeah, this dude is like more agile than my character. There's people back behind us now. 
Ah, not anymore. Oh, now there is again. The Panthers have strayed outside their natural habitat. Dock loot chests. These are pan dock loot chests or dock full of land with a weapon surprise by a speech action. Amazon's limited because dock ain't made of money. Where's, like, I don't get what the actual loot chest is. Oh, it's below me. Let's see what the good doctor has for this contestant. I guess we're gonna go do this over here first. The Casket of Chaos. I can see that there's somebody up there. You know, I was born in Takedowns. Oh man. Marshal, I welcome the challenge. Oh, yeah! Another victory for the collective! It's like a biathlon without the skis. Like there's another chest over here. Here. 
this should prove useful. Oh, the other chest is right here. Circus finale. This is the very last cast of chaos, and each run kicks off the murder circus finale. Choose your which chaos condition to save for the last, and load the dice in your favor. Guess what? Contestant matches your matches max level. They'll get to fight the rival in the next finale. How do I? Long range kills. I'll fight hand to hand if I must. Good show. Now my turn is coming. You deserve it. Ah. Los Panteros. A lack of dignity won't save you now. A hunter must be patient and persistent. That's it. Oh, shot. Gotta get them long range. Nothing like the thrill of the hunt. I guess that's not long range enough. That wasn't bad. You finished a run of Doc Ketchum's Murder Circus. What you gonna do with those boot coins jingling in your pocket? There's literally only one place to spend them. Mosey on over to the boat. Wait. Boot Coin Emporium. Buy more goodies to help you out. So you're level three. How do I get the rewards though? I do want a Molotov. I've been wanting fire from the beginning. So... 
Looks like you go up to level 8. I don't know. Well, we're, we're going to do another one on the next episode. So please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section below. I'll see you on the next episode. Have a wonderful day. God bless. Merry Christmas.